Hi, Cancerian! Welcome to my channel. We're doing your weekend reading. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, uh, for August 11 to the 13th, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. This is the current situation and what might happen, okay? Current situation and what might happen for the Cancerian. So we're gonna look first at the current situation that you're in, the time that you have watched this, if it resonates, okay? Let me see for the Cancerian. What's going on, Cancerian? If I look down, again, the monitor that they're supposed to put up is not yet up. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> okay, let's see. Let's see. The Devil card. Capricorn energy. Possessive, codependent. Sex. Let's dive into the, this uh, current situation that you're in. If any of those. Okay. This is a feeling of being attached to someone and not being able to let go. That's it. Conflict to make a decision. Number five, because this is the 15th, okay? Also, one and six over here. It's like um, conflict conflict and loss. But it's a battle because there's chain and shackles over here. Someone's connect, someone is just manipulating the situation, controlling the situation. Three of Wands over here. Three is all, you know, can be growth. Someone wants to grow out of this connection. Someone wants to expand because the new horizon is there. Someone is expecting a new cycle, a beginning to come towards them. High expectations though, Cancerian. Very high. And if the devil card is next me, when I do my reading, when it goes next to the uh, card, it, it heightens it. The sun heightens what is next. The devil card also heightens what is next. So high expectation. Un er, unrealistic expectation. This is the current situation that you're in. It's also the Tower of Apocalypse, just in case you're wondering. High expectation from afar, from a distance, foreign country. Ace of Swords over here. The distance is about... One, there's, you know, the expectation is there. And you guys are talking, communicating. Ace of Swords over here. Reality. This is about a reality check also from what I'm seeing. Like, what is this connection really? This is like codependent already. This is toxic now. Four of Pentacles, self-interest, greed. You see here, this person having all the Pentacles just for them. Okay. They're greedy. That's where the Devil card also. They only want you for themselves or vice versa. But the current situation is like... Um, it's like they're greedy because they protect their personal interests. The Four of Pentacles here is supposed to be stable. Um, but they watch your personal interests. That's why they're greedy. Eight of Pentacles. Someone can be also starting with a new work, new career, because they're learning. And then now it shows even their, their character. They're learning and focusing on something new. Well, not that new, it's already in the works. That's Eight of Pentacles. Now they're just learning the process. Ten of Pentacles. So they're involved with either family business, family stuff. Ten of Pentacles is about generations, money. Okay. Um, can be also from what I'm seeing here is one. You're even opening up to them spiritually. Okay. You're, you have been with them before. Okay. Because I see here there's five and the fifth house is about you know, relationship, girlfriend, boyfriend, not something that is binding. Um, and from what I'm seeing here is the tenth over here is that they're manifesting money really because this is how they need to be perceived. This is a tenth house. How people see them, how people see them is that, um, you know, money related. Like they're all about gains. They're all about themselves. Not themselves per se, but they're, they're trying to connect on who they should be in their life. And that's where their self-interest is right now. They're being greedy because they want to manifest something for them strongly. Strong, I should create that word already, strongly. Strongly, okay. But then it comes to the devil card because that's the only major arcana over here. It controls the whole situation. Whoever this is, this is the current situation. It's like a selfish energy because only one person will work and get the blessing over here. And it's only them. 
self growth i think i mean there's nothing wrong with that but they think they're they're dragging you in their self growth their own mission it's like come here i need you so that i can gain my ten of pentacles it's like a shackle their stability depends on you consider it okay so consider i'm gonna continue this reading on what might happen um the link is down there thank you very much guys for watching our weekend reading and i'll see you also on the weekdays bye